You know it's going to be a good day when you read this in the Coeur d'Alene Press editorial page. Fire Art Macomer. Yes, campaign contributions can get you a cushy government paycheck, which is something I suppose all the patriots on the Kootenai County Republican Central Committee strive for. God bless America. Back to reality. A week ago, the court ordered President Swain to be reinstated and the North Idaho College Board of Trustees complied reluctantly this past Monday, March 6th. Now, I should say two of them were enthusiastic about it. Three of them were reluctant, but first they had to remove that phony interim President South. The motion has been moved and seconded that the board's, NIC's Board of Trustees immediately places Dr. Gregory South on a paid administrative leave. Paid leave? Anyone still think these guys are conservatives? <laughs> no. And petulant uh, Chairman McKinsey tried to ram through the vote without any discussion. The, all those in favor of uh, placing Dr. South on uh, paid administrative leave say aye. Chair McKenzie, may I speak, please? Yes, you may. Thank you. Uh, I, I don't really understand why we're putting him on paid administrative leave. I think we should... Uh, actually terminate his contract we have a president we will as soon as we follow the court's order and we don't need the services of dr south any longer actually, actually uh trustee zimmerman we, we we did just kind of talk about this in executive session so since it is a sensitive personnel record no it's not executive session is to discuss discipline employee matters medical issues but not contracts which are public documents according to idaho code you know NIC could really benefit from an attorney. And we talked about legal opinions and matters of fact. We did not I'm talk about paid administrative leave. Move to leave. the question. So we did not talk about paid administrative leave. Well, if you would like to go back into executive session and talk about this, we can. We have another executive session scheduled at the end of the night. If there is no real to reason to go back. So I'm going to move. We're talking call the about question. Contract. You're welcome to try and overrule the chair. Just All right, that let's call the votes. Trustee Zimmerman, would you like to lead us in the vote? Thank you, this isn't the first time mckinsey has been rude to Trustee Zimmerman. Here's a gym from their December meeting where she remarks regarding the hiring of phony attorney Macomer. Very little confidence Trustee in Trustee Zimmerman, if you would not badmouth personnel. Okay, so I'll just say this. I, as I said before, I don't believe he's qualified as a collegiate uh, attorney, and I think his competency lies with himself. And Trustee so, Zimmerman, uh, I do believe that... I, I can't raise these concerns about who we hire for an attorney to represent us and guide us on these very important decisions. Back to the meeting. The big task, the one, the same three hoodlums, the jerks who, up until a judge's order, have done a tremendous job trying to destroy community college. It's, it's time to reinstate President Swain, which is sad news for McKinsey, who just can't emotionally handle the decision. Um. Okay. The board finds itself in a situation where Trustee Corkle, I think I'm anticipating your motion that uh, may I please 
have a motion to immediately take off Dr. Nick Swain from administrative leave. And if you feel that same way, would you please say so moved? I would make a motion to take Dr. Swain off of administrative leave and immediately place him back in the role of acting president of North Idaho College. Thank you, sir. Toward the end of that clip, and you can barely hear it, there are cheers coming from the overflow room, which was awesome. And here is the vote we've all been waiting for. Check out the pregnant pause by Banducci. Um, Trustee Banducci, we'll start with you. Aye. Trustee Wagner. Aye. Trustee Corkle. Aye. Trustee Zimmerman. Aye. All right, the motion passes. Four in favor. Is there a desire to go into executive session? I believe. Welcome back, Dr. Swain. I wish you the best in the good work of saving our college from these three Kootenai County Republican Central Committee Brit Reagan pals, rated and vetted clowns. Let's hope that the great leap in the right direction helps our college retain its accreditation and move forward for the North Idaho College faculty, staff, students, and the community. But there's a lot.